Our Summit to Know is part of a group of men considered the biggest in strength sports. He started bodybuilding in his early teens and won powerlifting competitions all around the world. Yeah, pretty impressive. And about a decade ago, he says his choices took him down the road to hell and back. And now, vying for a chance to be crowned the world's strongest man in 2021, meet Travis Ortmeier. Wait and more weight. Working up to 405 pounds to train for that perfect squat. Or a 200 pound dumbbell to finally nail a one armed lift. Yes. This is what professional athlete Travis Ortmeier calls a light day as he prepares to compete at World's Strongest Man 2021. My eighth world championship. I went seven years in a row up until 2011, and now a decade later, I'm going back. Ortmeier's story is bittersweet. I started my weightlifting journey when I was 11 years old. As he got older and stronger, he started competing and soon got his dad to do the same. Travis says when he discovered strongman competitions at the age of 20, he was hooked. The most fun I'd ever had in my entire life. Ortmeier traveled the world, breaking records. On the world record. And wowed crowds. Then a series of events and admittedly bad choices sent Ortmeier on a downward spiral. I had broken my ankle halfway through the final in 2010, World's Strongest Man. He finished fifth, but was soon hooked on painkillers. Then Travis says the real hurt came when his wife left him and took their little boy. Moved back to England with him. And that was on November 25th, 2012. It was the absolute worst day of my life. And then says Travis, the real nightmare began when someone he knew introduced me to crystal meth and uh, that week turned into four years. Ortmeier says during that time, he lost all his muscle, everything. And I was, I was weak as a kitten. Physically and emotionally. Ortmeier says he came face to face with the devil. I looked back and I said I wouldn't finished yet. He quit the drugs and says he clawed his way out of the darkness. By 2016, Travis was training again and this year was invited back to World's Strongest Man. And while winning is nice, Ortmeier says his real goal is to let his son know he's looking for him. It's big in England. He'll see it in England. And I want him to know that his dad loves him and his dad did not forget about him. The World's Strongest Man 2021 competition is happening right now in Sacramento. It continues through Saturday. As for recovery from his drug addiction, Travis says he fought that and the subsequent depression and anxiety by finding one thing every day to be grateful for. On day one, he says it was his feet. If you or someone you know needs help with mental health or addiction, we do have phone numbers and more resources listed with the online version of this story at KTVN.com. With someone to know, Andy Guevara for 2 News.